What's going on guys? How you guys doing today? Happy Thursday. Thirsty Thursdays. You already know. Nah, I'm joking. I have, actually I haven't drank in like almost, this is my fourth week not drinking. I'm actually happy for myself because, you know, I'm losing weight too. So, because alcohol is not, wasn't going to help it. So, you know, that's out of my, that's out of the picture. So, I mean, I'm not going to, I'm not saying I'm going to stop drinking, but for now on, I'm not drinking like that. So, it's been, this is my fourth week so far, so I'm going good. Anyways, I hope you guys are doing great, wherever you're at. Positive vibes. Tomorrow's Friday, we made it out of the week already. I just want to talk to you about um, pretty much the, what's going on worldwide. Oh yeah, one more thing. Um, my heart's go out to everybody in Florida, my cousins in Orlando and Tampa, West Palm Beach. Be safe, I love you guys. Uh, Hurricane Matthew is gonna go over there hard. Category four, over 150 miles. 150 miles per hour winds, it's crazy shit. Don't even go bother going outside if you don't if you don't need to. Please be safe. Um, I want to talk about um the, these clown sightings going on worldwide. Creepy ass clowns chasing everybody. Um, the truth of the matter is that some supposedly it's set up all these clowns. Uh, I don't know. I don't know if you guys remember the Purge election year, the movie, the third Purge. Pretty much. You know, when they were purging, they had clowns, clown costumes on, and then it, with that, and then they had kind of masks with, I don't know, um, Trump mask and a uh, Hillary Clinton mask. I don't know if you guys peeped that out. Check it out, the purge, election year, and pretty much just talking about going against the election this year, and they're, I guess the clowns, you know, trying to purge, and it's all subliminal message going on worldwide right now. Like, pretty much is really going on. With the clown signings and everybody, you know, and election days within next month, so it's just like conspiracy. Because that purge movie really told pretty much the truth, you know what I'm saying? And and you see the clowns just killing everybody in the movie, and and it's a it's the election year in the movie. It's like and and you see it, you think about it, it's going on in real life. And you're like, wow, this shit is. Yo, there's a story behind this, you know what I'm saying? Something's not adding up. It's it's always a meeting, especially with those purge movies. There's always a meeting to it. You know, and and like I said, there was there was a guy and a girl had they had a mask on representing one represent Donald Trump and the other represent Hillary Clinton. You guys should check out the movie. Check out Purge Election Year, the third one. And y'all see yourselves, man. There was clown people, there was people with clown costumes and masks. Purging all over the place, you know what I'm saying? It could be a meaning behind it, man, you know what I'm saying? Because the Illuminati works in mysterious ways, like, they, you know, conspiracies, like they always do. But, you know, the point is, you know, there's clowns going around and trying to chase people. It's just funny, you know, I, like, election day is next month, and they're doing this. They're starting to do this, you know, all around. There's been sightings out here where I'm at, Brownwood. I mean, you know, Long Island, New York. This in signs in North Carolina, um, all around the world, man. United States clown signs all over the place, man. And they, and it's crazy because the election day is next month. You know what I'm saying? It's there's always something. There's always a puzzle to solve, man. You just gotta look, observe, research it more. You know what I'm saying? Check out that Purge movie, though. I recommend. You can you'll see the clowns when they purge. During election year, and you'll see the, the the two people. They had one had a Trump mask and one had a Hillary Clinton mask. If you haven't, I mean, I mean, it, it looked like them. I mean, it could have been them, but it looked like them. There's a meaning behind it, and that's why these there's clowns out there worldwide doing this now. A month before election day, you know, what I'm saying it doesn't make it makes it make any sense now. We you know when we realize we solved the puzzle. Behind it, we realized that wow, this something's going on behind, behind closed doors. You know what I'm saying? Um, these clown sightings are gonna keep going and continuing. You know, chasing people with knives, little kids harassing people who's in the doors, the woods. You know, shit. If I see a fucking clown, man, you ready? No, I'm gonna fucking raise hell, man. Anyways, enough of those clown shits. Um, the story behind. Kim Kardashian, I spoke about it. It's been pretty much a distraction on um, what's really going on. Pretty much, um, they oh, they had like 530. They spent 500 500 billion dollars on making these ISIS videos. 
they're all fake anyways, you know what I'm saying? Pretending to cut somebody's head off, that's all fake. They put money into that, you know, to to because you know ISIS is set up by the CIA, so they put money into all that. And people they're just using the Kim Kardashian thing as a distraction so people won't know what's going really going on behind closed doors. And I'm guessing they're doing the same with these clowns, you know what I'm saying, for the election. But let me know what you guys think. Comment below. Feel free to like, subscribe, and be safe out there. Watch those clowns. Peace.